Hi there, I'm George from Green Feathers, and I'm here today to talk to you about how to mount one of our cameras inside our bird feeder, okay? Now, the first place to start is the instructions. These have got all the really handy, useful tips and hints on how to get the best out of using our feeder with the camera and how to mount it all up, and it's got great diagrams to help out. The next thing that we're going to go take a look at is the bird feeder itself. Now, this has got a longer side and a shorter side. It's designed as such so that we get the best viewing angle from our camera when mounted inside, and it's been optimized to make sure that we get the best out of it. On the longer side, we have a screw hole here set in that's going to be for the little eyelet ring so that we can clip our carabiner on that's going to hang our bird feeder. So that's what we're going to do first. The next bit that we're going to do is we're going to come over to the camera side of things. Now, inside the camera kit, we get the mounting screw inside the box, and we also have our Allen key to adjust the camera. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to pass the screw through the back of the feeder through the mounting hole halfway up the short side. I'm going to use a drill and the bolt and just pass it through nice and easily. I'm aiming to get it to the point where it's only just poking out on the opposite side. Now, I want to take my camera and I'm going to pop the camera in. Now, because I've got the feeder upside down, I need to make sure that I've got my camera going in upside down as well, nice and level. So the aerial on the top of this Wi-Fi camera denotes the top. So to do this, all I do is I line up the hole on the underside of our little camera here with the silver screw and bolt poking through, making sure that it's A upside down and B nice and level. From here, I can then carry on screwing out and it should go straight into the hole there when it's all lined up and neatly pull and mount the camera onto the bird feeder. So as we can see, we've now got our camera mounted up and the lead coming out and down, ready to go. So, our cameras aren't fully waterproof. So to help this out, we want to add our little waterproof cover because we're using the Wi-Fi camera here. So obviously what we have here is we've got the cable on this side, so we want to make sure that the little cable hole and cutout is on the correct side. So we just line that up and put the cable in. And I've just got four screws that I'm just gonna whiz in quickly with the drill. Don't forget to take your lens cap off of your camera. We can now clip our carabiner on and then we can go away and mount up our bird box with our bird feeder just snapping on and hanging neatly. Now that we've got our camera all mounted up inside our bird feeder, we're ready to go pop this down the garden and enjoy many happy hours of great footage of the birds. If you want any more information on any of our products, please go to our website, which is green-feathers.co.uk. Thank you so much for watching today, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and share.